Go. What's up, my peeps? This is your girl, Fabulous Fats. I'm here with my best friend, Louie. I call him the Raza. So if you guys follow me on social media and I say shout out to my Raza or this is my Raza. This is him. He's my best friend. He literally knows like almost everything about him, about me. So I'm about to test his skills right now. We've been best friends for, I want to say like 11, 11 and a half years. So he knows like literally like almost everything about me. So I'm going to put his knowledge to the test. And not only that, not only am I going to test him on how well he knows me, but we're also going to do a never have I ever. So it's going to be half how well does he know me and then half never have I ever. And we're going to drink it up. So we got some vodka right here. Which one do you want? This one or this one? So we got some vodka because you know your girl likes vodka. Let me pour the whole bottle. Shit. <laughs> we're, we're both not driving. He's not driving until later, later on today, and I'm at home. I'm stuck at home. He he came over today to visit me because I had told you guys in the other video I was a little bummed out. Damn, look, that's a lot of vodka. I told you I'm gonna yeah, do the whole we're, bottle. we're not skipping out right now. I'm gonna put juice in mine. You want juice yeah. yours? And um, so he came over. He brought me and my boyfriend some food, and he brought me some flowers right here. I love, love, love flowers. So thank you, Rasa. You're the best. So yeah, he's actually on vacation from work right now. So he was able to come through and come visit me and, and come spend some time with me. So I was like, hey, let's do a YouTube video real quick. And he, he like me, he's always down. We're the down people. It was a 70% alcohol, 30% juice. All right, guys. So we're going to go ahead and get started. We're going to start with... Uh, how well does Louie know me? And for that one, we're just going to sip on our drinks if we get thirsty. This is not a drinking game for this one. Or actually, if he gets cheer. it wrong, he, he should Cheers drink, first. right? Cheers. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So the first question is, what's my favorite football team? The Denver Broncos. I was going to say, if you don't get that right, I don't know, <laughs> I don't know if, you, if, you, if you're blind, bro. Okay, what's my favorite baseball team? The LA Dodgers. That's right, Dodgers. He's actually a super huge Angel fan. He even has a tattoo of the Angel uh, logo. No, actually my brother. Oh no, that's your brother, huh? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. You got the Superman. Yeah, the Superman. Just and kidding. His, his, him and his family are super, super hardcore Angel fans. And his brother has a big A tattoo. And that's why I confused him. I'm really close to his whole family, not just him. Um, so yeah, but I'm a Dodger fan. Um, what's my favorite color, Rasa? Red. That's right. Red is my favorite color, like burgundy, red. It's all the same to me. I love, love, love that she color. Liked, she likes all the colors, like the <laughs> rainbow colors. So one day it will be red, one day it will be purple, one day it will be green. But my favorite color is red, red though. Red. Like most of my clothes is red. And why he says that I, I like the rainbow color is because if you guys ever see me like on the channel, wearing i normally wear a lot of shirts that have flowers on it and some of the flowers they always different colors so that's why he's all like you just like the rainbow <laughs> which is which is funny but my favorite color is actually red um where do we where do we meet we met at a ups safety committee meeting that's right we actually met at work so yeah. we were we were both in the safety team and um we were in a meeting we conduct meetings every month regarding safety issues and stuff and that's where we actually met what was our first outing outside of work outing like what when time I, when i invited you to my nephew's baptism that's right that's I right i had a small gathering he said he had a small gathering, and i didn't know him like i know i'm hardcore mexican and um and i know how big my party my family parties can get even like the super small ones there's always like at least 100 people there um, but I didn't know that's how his family was too. And so I show up like just like I'm dressed cute, but like I'm not all done up. Like I, I just did a little bit of makeup, nothing too crazy. Like I didn't wear a dress or anything like that. And I get there and like his whole backyard is full of people. And I'm like, oh my God, I didn't know it was that big of a party. Cause he was like, oh, it's just a small party come through. And so I did come through. And then ever since he invited me to that party, um, he kept inviting me and inviting me and I kept going. And he has a big family like me. Like, how many siblings do you have? I have seven. Seven siblings. And I have 
I won't tell you because that's a question. <laughs> <laughs> um, but we have pretty big families and we're actually a lot alike. Like we do a lot of the same, we're hardcore Mexicans. So we do a lot of the same traditions and we're both really close to our families and stuff like that. So we get along really, really well. And then we're both kind of like dirty minded. Like we're just like, <laughs> we just both like to have a lot of fun. And we're like, we're not really shy. So that when we're together, we're like, we're too much for some people. Like when we went out, we went out, uh, cl was it a concert? We went to the concert. What concert was that? Oh, the Daddy Yankee one? Was it? Yeah, it was. It was we, Yankee, yeah. we Last year we went to a Daddy Yankee uh, concert. Right here and, in Ontario. Right here in Ontario. And um, he and his girlfriend slept over at my house. <laughs> and his girlfriend's really shy and my boyfriend's really shy, but we're outgoing and we're loud and we're outspoken and we're both like very like not shy about our sex life or whatever we don't even mean it serious it's just like a joke and both of our significant others are like oh my god i can't believe she said that and then and then they both laugh at us like oh my god you guys do that on purpose to embarrass us and low-key sometimes we do yeah, i know we do it to, to make them sometimes. uncomfortable to make them you should always be you should always be yourself yeah and we're all, we're ourselves you know and obviously they learn to love us the way we are so they already know how we are and they know we're kidding and they don't take it personal but you know we're just very like unique yes unique next question uh what's my favorite dish chile rellenos that's right um i don't eat chile rellenos often i don't make chile relleno often because they're really hard to make in my opinion like the specific way i like them and the specific way i want them they're really really hard to make and they're very very tedious in work so it's just like sometimes i'm like damn I want them so bad, but am I willing to like cook for three hours to make them happen? Like, mm, I don't know. So um, I actually don't eat them that often. I want to say maybe I eat them once or twice a year. Only during Quaresma. <laughs> I know. I actually, I'm no lie. I'm going to be cooking some chile rellenos like maybe this week or next week because I've been hardcore craving them. Um, how old am I, Raza? 30. That's right. And he's cheating because I'm the same age as one of his younger sisters. And actually, Louis is the same age as my boyfriend. So he, my boyfriend and him are the same age. And me and his youngest, youngest sister are the same age. So he can never really forget my age. Um, how many siblings do I have? Four. Do you know their names? Yeah, Jerry, Jocelyn, Anita, and Mary. <laughs> right? <laughs> no. <laughs> I know you know their names because yeah, you always know, tell me just, their names, but I think just the one sister. I think you're just nervous. Um, <laughs> I know I forgot her name, but she's a cosmetic one. I want to tell her what I was. So my older sister's name is Anita. Then there's me. Then there's. Marlene. Marlene. There we go. <laughs> Sorry, Marlene. <laughs> then there's Marlene. Then there is Jerry. And then there's my baby sister. Not Jocelyn. Jaylene. Jaylene. <laughs> my bad. <laughs> Sorry, guys. It's a little hot. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, uh, how, how did my boyfriend and I meet? Oh, through a very good friend, Marcel. That's right. Uh, my friend, Marcel. Hi, Marcel. Hi, Marcel. What's up? um basically like uh my boyfriend and marisol were good friends and they uh she would invite us to events and stuff and it would always be four of us me him her and then louie and then we were always the down crew like oh let's go on a trip to san diego down let's go to vegas okay down let's go uh snowboarding okay mm -hmm. down let's go do it like we're we're that kind of people so she would invite us and we would go and then that's mainly how i met him was through her um, how long have I been at work? How long have I had that job for? Uh, 12 years. That's right. Because if you have me on social media, I posted recently that I just hit my 12 year anniversary. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you. How long have you been there? 13? Uh, it's going to be 13 in the end of May. All right. Damn. So we've been with the same company for a minute. Um, okay. So that's the end of how he knows me. He only got like my siblings names wrong. Sorry, but, buddy. But but it's 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 uh it's all right because when he actually sees him in person he remembers i think right now he just felt like on the spotlight because he'll, he'll go to my sister and he'll be like hey marlene uh whenever he comes over to he comes over to my family events a lot too so and her mom's a great cook by the way yeah too. my mom she's the shit 
So um, so we're gonna skip to we're gonna skip to the next level. The next one's never have I ever. We're not gonna be super specific about the answers. We're just gonna answer it and leave it like that. And then obviously never have I ever. So if we have done it, we're gonna drink. And if we haven't done it, we're not gonna drink. If not, we're still gonna drink for the heck of it too. <laughs> yeah, so we're just gonna get tore up today. All right, so the first one is never have I ever had sex in public. Cheers. And when I tell you guys that Louis is my best friend and he knows everything about me, I mean everything. Like, I'll tell him and I'll be like, oh my God, I did this. Oh my God, like this happened. And sometimes he'll be like, TMI, Fabi, TMI. And he'll be like, oh, you scarred me, you scarred me. But I tell him everything. But now I tell her worse, so. <laughs> now, he, now he gives me the payback and tells me even worse. And I'm like, oh, Rosa, don't tell me. Oh, I don't want to know. But yeah, I know everything about him too. Uh, never have I ever been to a strip club. Boy or girl? Girls, of course. I've only been to a girl strip club. And this drink's pretty good, huh? It is. Um, never have I ever kissed a, a stripper. Nasty. No judgment. <laughs> Never have I ever had a threesome. <coughs> Cheers, Rosa. Never have I ever been in a fight. Ooh. I'm a lover, not a fighter. Not a fighter. Never, never have I ever had surgery. Cheers. Never have I ever gone to a magic show. Oh, I did. Vegas. Yeah. Thanks, Eddie. Thanks, Eddie. Never have I ever been to an amusement park. Fun fact, guys. Louie and I love, love, love Six Flags. We love rides. Like, literally, like, we get a pass, like, almost every single year, huh? And then we get it for each other because our significant others, like, they, did, they didn't really like rice. So we'll just be like, hey, you down to get a pass? And he, he'd be like, you're down to get a pass? And then we'll just go together <laughs> and much. get on all the rides. But I hate, hate, like, big drops. So if you have ever been to um, Six Flags, they have that big ride that's called the Goliath. And I hate that ride. And that's Louis' favorite ride. One of his favorite rides because he also loves Superman. And I remember one time we went with him and all his siblings and and I was telling them like I hate that ride I don't want to do it guys and they were like, okay, it's okay if you guys don't want to do it If you don't want to do it, it's okay So they were trying not to pressure me because they saw how scared I was and I'm legitly like scared and um, And then I felt bad like oh, uh, it's our first time being here all together because normally me and him go by ourselves but that time it was like the whole little crew and I mm -hmm. get along with his whole family, not just him. So it was like, oh, I was like, man, I felt guilty, you know, like, like, I'm not going to go on the, fr and that's the first ride they wanted to go on even worse. I like to kind of warm it get up on first. Yeah. Let's get on first. And, I, and I like to warm it up, like start off with little ones to kind of get me back in the rhythm. And he was like straight that one. And I ended up going, huh? Did I, I think I cried. Didn't I cry? Yeah, he cried. And bit. then in the picture, I'm like this. <laughs> Like, like legitly, like holding on. Oh, and I hugged the, I hugged the, I was hugging you, I think, and I was hugging the car, or the little, the little, the, the car, car, yeah, the yellow car. And I'm like, ah, hugging the car and hugging. I'm all like, hugging I don't know where her more, like, the right or her, or, or her arm, please. Oh or. my God, it was so scary. I cried. I hate that ride. I think I almost blacked out because I was just in so much fear. Um, we but need yeah. to go back. I yeah, that. we do gotta go back. I love mm -hmm. Six Flags. Um, never have I ever gotten a piercing. Mm. Never have I ever gotten a tattoo. Mm. Mm, I like this game. Mm -hmm. Never have I ever gotten a ticket. Ooh, yes. A lot of concert tickets. Concert ticket and speeding ticket. <laughs> <laughs> Never have I ever been to jail. Nope. 
I'm a law-abiding citizen, guys. I'm crazy, but I'll mess with the law. Never have I ever been fired. No. Never have I ever had sex with somebody else in the room. Not necessarily watching, but just in the room. Mm. Cheers. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Once again, it's my best friend, Louie, my raza. And I'll see you guys later. Have a good one. Stay safe.